Hello again, this is Hiro Uzuki with part 92 of my Fallout New Vegas Let's Play, the game in which the Great Cons didn't take it very well when they found out how Carl really felt about them. I mean, they started shooting the man, they shot him dead, and then they just kept shooting. It was rather humorous to watch, actually. And it made clear that they are adherents to anime rule number 24. There is no such thing as overkill. Yup. And you know something? I can get behind that. Now, uh, I remembered what it was I was forgetting to do. <laughs> Got a couple of odd jobs that I need to take care of for the NCR. So we're gonna go ahead and do that before we get on with the main story with the NCR. You have to hand it to the NCR. Get enough hands working together and they can make or break just about anything. Yeah, but here's the thing, ever since President Tondi died, the NCR is more or less broken everything they've gotten their hands on. Crying shame. Now it's nothing more than a broken democracy, ruled by the rich. Ugh, that strikes a little too close to home. Hey there, Major. I hear you've got a bit of a fiend problem, and I might be able to take care of that. If it's bad news, you can take it up with the Colonel. If it's good news, it better involve some dead fiends. Damn right I am, and I'm paying bounties. I've got three fiends I want dead, and I don't give a goddamn how it gets done. Guess no. That sound like something that interests you. And what names? First one calls herself Violet. God knows why. The name is the prettiest thing about her. Spends most of her time with a pack of vicious dogs. Then there's Driver Nafai. He's fast, and he's brutal. Killed about a dozen of my men with a goddamn driver iron. Hence his name. And finally, Cook Cook. Rapist, pyromaniac. Asshole. Damn good it. chef, if you believe the fiends we've captured. I don't believe Probably you. the craziest of the lot. I'm not gonna feed you any bullshit. These aren't your common Vegas trash. No, they're common They've Vegas bullshit. They've all killed bullshit. good NCR men, and plenty of mercs, too. You go after them, any of them. You're in for a hell of a fight. I don't believe that. So, which one is it gonna be? Da, 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 da. If you've got some guts, I'll give you that. Nefi is one tough son of a bitch. You let him get close, and he'll take your head off. Like hell he will. My advice is this. Talk to Lieutenant Gorobetz. He's in charge of Alpha Team, first recon. Snipers. If you're lucky, you can lure Nefi into the open and the sharpshooters can bring him down. You bring me the head, you'll still get the bounty. Nice. It's a better bet than trying to take Nefi one-on-one, -on -one, but it's your call. It's actually recommended that you take the snipers with you, because even if you don't end up using them in, in their entirety, they'll still pay you caps for going with. So, yeah. Out in the yard, Gorobetz coordinates our sniper teams. He's been gunning for Nefi for weeks now. Only thing he you hasn't had is willing bait. Got it. Don't have enough troops to order anyone beyond the fence. Not anymore, anyway. One more thing. If you want the full reward, you need to bring me a recognizable head. No headshots. My superiors Got need it. proof they're gone. That means no headshots, no decapitations till after they're dead, and no damage to the face. If you want to be safe, aim for the chest. You bring me a head that looks like a rotten tomato, people will be doubting, and I won't be authorized to pay the entire bounty. Again, Good luck to no you. headshots. And don't get Got careless. It. Who, me? Never. Right. I'm not exactly a mercenary, but taking out scumbags of this magnitude wouldn't cause me to lose any sleep. Noted. Okay. Just don't be gone long. I sunburn easily. The sun's already going down. Also, I'm leaving Ganon here because uh, that plasma pistol of his is likely to, you know, gooify the Hello. targets. So, we won't um, go quietly. <clears throat> the Legion can count. What can I do for you? Can use some help. Whatever you need, we'll make sure it gets done. What did you have in mind? You thinking of luring him into range of my snipers? Sounds like fun. Can we hit him? Damn straight we can. Question is whether he kills you before we get a clear shot. Never. It's one hell of a risk you'd be taking. But if you're willing, we'll do everything we can to keep you alive. Just make sure you shoot straight. Listen, my team has a debt to settle with Nefi. We've seen too many of our boys get brained by that golf club of his. 
You lure him out for us, and if we can score some payback, we'll all pitch in caps for a reward. My team will take up positions around the old rock crushing plant. They'll wait until they scenify, and then they'll start shooting. At that point, just keep your head down and stay out of range of his golf club. We'll take care of the rest. Noted. Get your rifles and move out first, Recon. We've got a fiend to kill. Fuck, I love this rifle. God, fuck it. I can't just get close enough that I can see him. She's not getting back up. Uh, wrong way. This way. This way. Does that one? Go ahead and take these. Some more stuff I can sell off. You deserve frequent flyer miles for that. Just. My own personal opinion. And now we run. Come along, assorted assholes. Time for some exercise. You like the sight of your own blood? Snipers. Where is that like backup guy? Wait, I gotta resolve this issue myself. Oh, now you guys showed up. Okay, enough. Come on. All right. Let's go ahead and take that as well. You came through for us. I have to admit, I wasn't sure you'd make it. I wasn't sure you'd Means make it. Means a lot, it. letting my team get payback. Here, we all pitched in some caps for you. Even Sterling, and he's famous for his tight wallet. Awesome. Carry on. What, dude, what happened to you? 
did you step on a mine getting out here? Good God. I mean, I appreciate the commitment to the bit, but... Dude, maybe... Maybe get some stim packs, a couple of bandages. Hell, even a band-aid for those legs. Oh my God. Anyway, I've got your head here for you. Don't ask for the golf oh, club. I'm keeping it. I see that. you're still alive, and that's promising. Any luck on that bounty? That right. You killed one of the psychopaths on my shit list. Yeah, sure. Let's Let go with that. Let me see the scumbag's head. Well, well, well. Driver Nafai. Nothing to say, you son of a bitch. No tips on my golf swing. Lost a lot of good men to this psychopath. Morale's gonna be better now that he's gone. Here's the bounty I promised. Neat. I guess we can send First Recon down to Camp Forlorn Hope. They need all the help they can get there. Damn right I do. Who do you think you can take down? Let's, uh... Let's go after the cook. One thing I should tell you about Cook Cook. Piece of shit is pure animal. He raped one of my snipers, and that makes this personal. Also, he's got a flamethrower, and he's damn good with it. From what I hear, he either rapes or burns every living thing he gets his hands so on. So he's a real scum of Only radiator. one man's gotten close to killing him, and that's little Buster. So he says, anyway. Maybe it's bullshit, but I'd still ask him about it. Bounty Hunter talks big, but he's still alive, so he can't be completely full of shit. I think he's out in the yard waiting to claim a couple bounties. You've gone after the fiends before. I don't have to tell you to keep alert. Good luck. Right. Actually, the only thing you really need to know about Cook Cook is that he's got a Brahmin named Queenie, and if you kill her, he frenzies. But I don't see why I should have to kill the Brahmin just to get that piece of shit. I mean, a Brahmin's just a two-headed cow. Twice the soulful stare. Sir Orman. Why would you kill such a soulful animal? There's no real need to. So that, and that, and that, that, that. Here are those missing parts. Nice. Awesome. Very awesome. Yes. All right. Kill the cook! This is one cook you do not want to kiss. You want to kill it. And yes, I said it. He does not deserve to be called. But, shit, I just went and said that. You know what? Kill it. It. Do not refer to it as a thing, as a person. It is an it. Still, you piece of stool. Huh. 
kill the Brahmin. Why, why didn't that, those first two rounds kill him? saw your friend's head pop like a fucking zen, you just turned around and walked away. <laughs> I'm surprised you were bold enough to get this close. Take out both your legs. Now, I claim your head. This, and this, this is mine now. And no, you cannot have this stuff back. And not just because you're dead. You get to live, Queenie. You get to live, and live a better life, now that he is gone. Be free, you majestic creature. Be free. Live the best damn Brahmin life you can. A platoon of veteran rangers is like a tactical nuke, only tougher to scare. What can I do for you? We're the finest sniper outfit in the whole NCR. And you've got two broken you legs bullet, still. Please do something about that. If you need a bullet, put away, you call us. Some of my team aren't without their share of scars, though, like Betsy and Sterling. Cook Cook, one of the fiends, ambushed her and ten of spades. They both managed to escape, but not before Cook Cook raped her. Betsy shrugged it off like it was nothing, but her behavior keeps getting worse. Always making passes at every woman who wanders by. It's inappropriate for anyone at first recon to behave that way. I could discipline her, but I'd rather she get medical help. I'd appreciate it. As her CO, I could order her to get help, but I'd have her agree with the idea. Corporal Sterling was an NCR Ranger until he was captured by the Legion. They tortured him pretty badly. He wasn't able to be a ranger after that, but his eyes are still sharp, so I had him transferred to first recon. Carry on. I Never seen you around before. What do you want? Cook is dead. You killed him? Well, shit. Here I dreamed up this whole elaborate revenge fantasy. Sorry. Didn't really think I'd do it, but as long as the tubby bastard was actually alive, I could pretend like I would. Here, I owe you. Take it and get out of here, before I indulge my inner bitch and spoil the moment. No. What a pointless trip. Here I thought I'd get a shot at that junkie bastard. The lieutenant's been talking to you, hasn't he? He was right Look, next to you. How did you not I don't need hear? a head doctor. I'm first recon, damn it. You don't see the others crying about every little bruise and scrape, do you? Can still 
you down or distract you, but it's treatable, just like any bullet wound. Just another injury to take care of, huh? Well, when you put it that way. All right. You can tell the lieutenant I finally caved. There's a Dr. Usanagi who's supposed to be good at this sort of thing. All right. Yeah. Try not to get killed. Tell that to your first lieutenant, please. He has two broken legs. Please, someone help lieutenant him. Veteran Rangers is like a tactical nuke. What can I do for you? First thing you could do is get your legs fixed. I wish someone with your medical training had come along sooner. I think she'll actually stick with the treatment because of what she said. I was afraid that Betsy wouldn't go for long-term treatment because she didn't want to look bad in front of the rest of the squad. You settled that. Do me a favor and let Usanagi know Corporal Betsy is coming. I'd like to make sure the medical clinic has time for her. Noted. Carry on. You Maybe you should also visit the medical clinic too. You know, for those legs. Someone please tell him to go see the doctor. Someone carry the poor guy. Hey. Hi. Hi, Doc. You're back. Mental trauma can be just as debilitating as physical injuries. Fortunately, I'm well qualified in such treatment. Neat. I'll make time in my schedule. Awesome. All right, let me do a quick... All right, you're healthy enough to handle another one. Which surgery are you considering? Let's see, uh, da, 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 agility. The reflex booster does exactly what it says. Speeds up your reaction times. For 4,000 caps, I can attach the implant to your central nervous node. Here you go. Have a seat in the auto dock. This will take a few hours. I am, again, a substantially augmented human being. Not a cyborg, just substantially augmented. All right, let's turn on that bounty now. Got any more good news for me? I've got you a head. You killed another one. Let me have a look at the head. Yeah, that's Cook Cook. Ugh, did he always smell like this, even before he was dead? And the fiends let this guy touch their food? Well, this is payback for at least one of my troopers. She'll be glad to know he's dead. Here's your caps. Eight. That's two psychopaths dead. If you can bring down the third, there's a bonus in it for you. Can do. Violet it is. Wish I could give you more advice on how to bring her down, but we know less about her than the other two. Just watch out for the dogs. She raises them herself. Might as well be their mother and never leave her side. Good question. Fiend territory is southeast of here, but they range all over the area. None of them stays in any one place for long. You've gone after the fiends before. I don't have to tell you to keep alert. Good luck. Right. Okay, well, I think I can go ahead and bring Ganon along for this one. So long as I knock her ass, uh, our ass, then, uh, yeah. Well, actually, no. No. I'll take her down myself, and then I'll bring him along for our raid into Vault 3. We need to go ahead and kill Motor Runner. That way we can say that we got rid of the fiends for good. Damn it. 
haven't got myself turned around again. I do need to go through here. Are we absolutely sure she's here? Please hold still. been putting that one off, hadn't I? He did. Wait, come back, please. I must lodge a bullet in your sternum. Okay, not quite your sternum, but good enough. Seems like I just dealt with a load of fiends for no damn good reason. <laughs> eh, whatever, I'm sure it was amusing to somebody.
knows your dog is catching on fucking fire. You're a terrible owner. for the killing of animals, I did this in self-defense, knowing full well that they were going to attack me. I'll take your head. Thank you. Splat. Most gruesome. Quartz. Neat. I need that later. Already over here. Might as well go ahead and deal with this problem myself. Sorry, dude. Who's got the balls? We learn, children. Don't fuck with me. Yes, yes, children. No need to fight me. No need to fight at all. for two very hey, common items. Yeah, I can't find any. Seems like when I really need something, it's nowhere to be found. What the hell? Science juice. 
Christ, where's all the turpentine? What the fuck are you looking at? I'm looking at you. Get the fuck out of my way. I know you're not talking to me. Hey, got any jet? None to share with you, unfortunately. Ask someone else. I'll take those just so I can say that I've got them. all the Abraxo? Where's all the turpentine? This is a fucking vault. They should have this stuff. The cons are all gone. I wonder if they left behind their shit for making our goods. Lodge of explosive round in his head. How about that? Huh? What do you say? I'm sure, it'll be great. You heard nothing. I do have to ask, what do you think of my magic trick? It makes assholes disappear. Are you impressed? If not, I can understand it. It just makes assholes disappear. It doesn't really do much of anything else. Uh, don't go looking for your boss. Don't go looking for him. He uh, he doesn't want to be disturbed. He said he's got a massive headache. Like you would not believe. So just leave him alone. Leave him alone and he'll get better. Maybe. bounty. I think I'm forgetting something. Shit, that's right, that's right. Gotta go back, gotta go back. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Gotta wrap up a quest. Wrap up a quest real quick. Alright, how can I forget about that? The cons are all gone. Wonder if they left behind their ship for making our goods. Uh, da, 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 da. 
Gotta find that NCR soldier around here. Somewhere around here. Hey, got any jet? All I have is psycho. Liar, bitch. Children, please. Behave yourselves. No effort. Tracks it again. Focus. Focus. Damn. I think I got some bad shit. What, you think you're gonna have mass blowout or something? Cons are all gone. Wonder if they left behind their ship for making our goods. Don't tell me you guys ate the Obraxo cleaner thinking it was it was more chems. More drugs isn't the answer. Dead body, thank you. Almost no effort. Caesar no more. What the fuck are you looking about at? Improving the lives of regular folks around here. Get the fuck out of my way. Mark my words. Won't be long before the Legion and NCR butt heads over Hoover Dam.
need to move faster, damn it. I'm trying to get stuff done. First try, on the second try. Woo. Someone is targeting us. I'm gonna kill that fucker if we find out who did it. Who knows? That fucker could be amongst you right now. I mean, I'm not pointing any fingers, I'm just saying. They could be here. Drugs. Should really lay off that stuff. And another idiot who couldn't put the drugs down. Don't do drugs, kids. like them after all, right? The cons are all gone. I wonder if they left behind their ship for making our goods. Why are you asking me? Need to lay off the drugs. Just stop taking drugs. 
Stop it. This guy is. The cons are all gone. Wonder if they left behind their ship for making our goods. I'm pretty sure they're still in the Red Canyon. Well, for now, anyway. Come the second Battle of Hoover Dam, though, I can't guarantee that. There is no shame in looking up some help. Wow, they're just walking out of here. You're not doing anything to stop them. Okay. are all gone. Wonder They're they still here. someone killed Motor Runner. Oh, is that a fact? Oh, well, well didn't I tell you that uh, he didn't want to be bothered? Well, that's pretty good for not listening. You found out the grim truth. I'm 
thinking we might go ahead and stop here and uh I'll take up the whole problem of finding this guy. God damn, I need a in the next part. Cause this is wearing on my nerves just a little bit. And I was in such a good mood. So yeah, not the most pleasant place to stop, but let's go ahead and stop here while the stopping is good. Thank you for watching the video. If you enjoyed it, then consider hitting the like button, the subscribe button, leaving a comment, and hitting that bell to stay updated with more videos from me. With that, this is Hiro Uzuki, signing off. Seriously, you guys need to lay off the chems, clean your shit up, get your lives together, make something of yourselves. Fuck's sake.